Alright guys, hopefully today camera angles are a bit better. I tried switching it around a little bit. I'm just getting home from school. I work out right after school. Yesterday was a weekend, today's Monday. So I'll probably post my chest workout I just did. Today, sometime tomorrow maybe. I'm not sure. But I'm I'm also not sure if I'm gonna be recording all of my weekly workouts. It really depends on maybe how the video is doing, I don't know. But hopefully I'll be able to record every each and every single workout I do. And then maybe if you guys like this, I'll record every other workout after that and invest in some more things to actually be able to record these. So yeah, we're going to turn it back there. We're going to start off with, with some warm-up sets, like always, three warm-up sets of. All right, first warm-up set. If I face the camera, maybe this would be a good angle. But overhand rows. Just a couple of warm-ups just getting used to the movement. And then I, these are adjustable weights, so obviously you can have these and everything like that. So pretty nice. Otherwise, let's go on to the next warm-up set here. All right, second warm-up set, up the weight, five pounds. So I believe 40 is on here now. Alright, hopefully you'll be able to see me now. I'll try to bring the camera angle a little bit higher. But I'll adjust these. I just, my working weight for these are normally 47 and a half pounds. Normally around 15 reps. I also do drops at the smaller 20 pound weights to get the extra squeeze but yeah i'll be adjusting these off camera and everything too just so you guys know and then last warm set until we go into the working sets all right last warm set <clears throat> all right now going to the working sets we're gonna do today I'm doing four different exercises so Four sets of each four exercises, which I'll go through during this workout, obviously. But I'm gonna be changing these weights quick, and we'll get into the working exercises. All right, this is gonna be our first first set using this new weight. We normally do 45, we're up to 47 and a half, so aim maybe 12, at least 12 reps, and we'll drop set with the 20s. All right, there we go. And obviously on that little drops up the twenties, I. I could go a lot longer. I just do it to get some extra, you know, squeezing on my back. But that's first set done, and go on to the next one. All right, second set. Let's get it. I'm trying to get all my my whole move, my whole body in the camera. Sorry about that. But continue doing the second set done. So 
12 with sets or 12 reps let's go next set all right third set you guys should be able to see me a lot better now i realize i could like on zoom on my camera a bit so that should help widen the frame all right third set Yeah, once again, just getting that good squeeze in your back just makes you feel even better when you're doing exercise. Anyways, pretty good. Let's go on to the next set. Feeling great. Final set for these rows, and then we'll go on to strength exercise. done with the rows. Next exercise I'm going to be doing is kind of funky, but I've been doing it for almost a year, so for me personally, it's giving me a nice stretch and burning my back. Not many people do it, but it's what I got to work with with these dumbbells I have. So let's move on to that. And yeah, I'm trying out all different kinds of camera angles, zoom ins, like whatever, just trying to figure out what works best. So sorry for all the messing around with the camera. I'm hopefully going to be able to get, like I said, more stuff to get better angles in the future. So yeah, let's go on to the next exercise. Next exercise, going lightweight and I like to call these back flies, I guess you could say. So I'll, I'll try facing this way to start off with, maybe facing the next way just to see how the angles are. So let's, if you go in here, aim for 12 reps. Do some squeezes to get that contraction. Maybe one more. Once again, doing a little squeeze at the end to get that contraction in your back. Just feels great doing that. But yeah, those actually might seem a bit weird to you, but if you try it, you can really feel it do well in your back. I also hit 13 reps at a time, even though sometimes I'm cheating a little bit. 13 reps. Pretty good exercise. Move on to the next set. Right. Second set. Try facing you guys this way this time.
Once again, traction. All right, pretty good. I feel like I don't know if I'm gonna be recording these much. Maybe I will, cause it, it kind of lowers my focus when I am working out and you need to switch around the camera so often. So maybe I can actually buy a real camera just record my whole workout, get like a thing to actually like stand it up and it'll be much, much easier. So if you let me guys know, let's go on to the next set. Third set. <clears throat> Another great set. Four reps. Let's go on our next one. See how high it was cut off me here, the two ones, so I'll peep through some of this right now so you guys can see my whole body once again. Sorry about that. Finish with that. Going on the next exercise. Doing some single hand dumbbell rows. So yeah, let's get it. Single, just doing single arm dumbbell, dumbbell rows, each side. And for 12 here, 45 pounds. Thirteen on that one. We got 13, 12. Pretty nice. Last time we got 12 on 12, so you me on the next set. Pretty good. Next set. Try and straighten my back out a bit.
talking to. Pretty nice once again. Good stuff. Going next set. Not much else to say. Third set. <clears throat> Feeling great. Right, man. Kind of cheated on that last one. Normally at the end of them, I'll actually do this sometimes. Just again to a little squeeze. Honestly, I forgot to do them, but I'll be able to do it for these next coming sets. One more set, and then next exercise, last exercise, and we'll be all done with. Last set. <clears throat> Feeling great. That's all right. Better next time. <clears throat> all right, guys. That's it for dumbbell rows. Time to do some lat pull-downs on my machine. I'll do some lat pull-downs. Aim for 12 reps. And we'll do some partial reps at the end, too. Just like that, that's that pull downs on this machine. This little bike, my mom just got, so that's gonna be in the frame for the rest of the videos. But that's all right. Maybe I'll zoom up the camera, but yeah, that's that pull downs. Let's go on to the next set. All right, hopefully, I think I'm gonna tip over. Aim for 12 again. Let's get it. <clears throat>
be on a pretty nice set. Do two more tests to go and a workout phone bone set, so hopefully it doesn't die. So if it does die out, that's why I haven't got the last two sets, but it has to go on the next two sets. So aiming for 12 again. Let's go. <coughs> Once the windows get that extra little squeeze. So, yeah, again, great set. Last set, we actually do a drop set. Basically, tail failure. And really, it's a squeeze in the back. So, great. On the last set. All right, last set. Once again, we'll be doing a drop set at the end. So, let's go. <coughs> Lowering the weight down, 10 pounds. Just earlier. Workout complete. Be another another great workout. Let me know if you guys want to see more of this. Again, more of these workouts once again. I'll keep improving on this every single day and go from there. All right, guys. It's kind of hard to balance this stupid thing, but I feel like go down. I mean, you got a good pump. Hopefully you can a good back pump. Looking pretty good. But yeah guys, let me know if you want to see more videos like this. Once again, just wanna try and entertain you guys. Show how I work out at home as a 14 year old. Just trying to, you know, get decent big decent gains, become something. So let me let me know if you guys want me to keep doing more of these workout videos. And yeah, let me know if you like this. Thanks for watching.